me and my family apply for Habitat for Humanity so we can have our own home and it can be affordable and we can give our children a better life. Home means a place that I can raise my family and that they can be safe in and something to just to call our own. This has actually been our first home, and, and I really mean it in the sense that uh, we lived in apartments before, but this is really where we've uh, started to make our memories. And for example, you know, my son, uh, Benjamin, just had his birthday, and uh, the fact that we have a you know, a, a home that has stairs, and he was running, they were running up and down the stairs with all the kids running after them, and hear them running and laughing in their room. You know, that was just uh, amazing to me, and, and it's just, it's, it's a great memory, and I know there will be many more. The places that I have lived, my kids can't play outside. There's a parking lot on either side of my front door and my back door, and it's not a great neighborhood by any means and there's a lot of violence that goes on in the area. I always thought about owning a home, but never really thought that I would be able to afford it. I was so excited that the next day we came and we kept coming down Wall Street <laughs> looking for a lot. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I think we just, just, just came like, let's go, to, let's go find out where, where the house it could be or where it's at or, you know, what was funny was, that we didn't know that much about habitat, so we're we're thinking that it could have been, uh, you know, like a right. older older house or a, you know a condo or something. We really really didn't expect for something new. So when I came up and down and I didn't really didn't see nothing. I seen older houses. I said, yeah, I seen some older houses. And um, but when they told us it's the the piece of land over there is gonna be brand new, I was like, what? Brand new? It was great. In order to get my own Habitat home, I had to put in 500 hours of sweat equity. That includes working on my house, other people's homes, working down at Restore, we go to a lot. It's tiring with work, but I always feel accomplished at the end of the day. Like, I did something that was worthwhile. My kids feel good when they go out to Youth United. They have a lot of fun, they've made a lot of new friends, and um, I've also met a lot of people that, you know, kind of feel like a family. Well, the 500 hours were very intense, <laughs> but it was so worth it. We learned a lot. I did things that I never thought that I would have done, um, getting up on a ladder, working on my home without having stairs. And Building scaffolds building <laughs> FOs, digging holes outside, um, carrying rocks. It's just so much more that you get from, from, from actually working those 500 hours than what you, you know, what you put in. So it's just, uh, just amazing, you know, working with other, other people and, you know, learning about their, their experiences with, with Habitat and all that, it's just great. Well, even after um, our 500 of Sweat equity hours. I have continued to volunteer for Habitat. I volunteer because I'm very appreciative and I also want to help other families and be an example to them that you could do it. I just love Habitat. <laughs> I'm actually really excited about Christmas and things like Thanksgiving because where we are now, it's always really cramped but now we'll, we'll be able to have space and we'll be able to do more things together. And I'll actually finally be able to have a real slumber party like with all of my friends because it's usually just me and my friend Vanessa and I never got to have any of my other friends over and now I can.
how would that we own our home and uh, we pay taxes? I think it's, uh, it's just a privilege that we contribute to uh, our communities pay paying taxes and, and uh, knowing that those, you know, those taxes are going toward fixing other communities and our, you know, making our, our communities safe is just uh, a sense of respect that has just been you know, given to us. These places in, 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 in Bridgeport has been, they haven't been given that good view of a place to live at, but I'm hoping that with, uh, like with Habitat you know, and, and other homeowners, uh, that we could change that about Bridgeport and that people could feel safe and know that uh, if we, we stay together and, and we build good homes and uh, we take care of our homes and our communities that we could change not only our neighborhoods but the whole city. I see my purpose in life as taking care of my children first and then myself. I want for them to be happy a lot. <sighs> a lot of what I do is for my kids. And I want them to understand that I love them with all my heart. Here we are in our new home, and it's just such a you know great blessing for us and our and our family. Um, and anything you want to add, honey? <laughs> I love you. Thank you.